weekly paychecks. Um, I wanted to shoot this quick webinar just to go over some things for those of you who are coming into Get Weekly Paychecks who are pretty much brand new and have no clue on what to do and, and how to market. So this webinar is going to be an overview of basically how to market GWP. Uh, I'm going to be going over some free marketing uh, techniques and I'm also going to be going over some paid marketing techniques. I'm going to show you guys how to get everything set up so that you can run uh, this business efficiently and effectively and get your marketing campaigns out. So with that being said, what I'm going to do is go ahead and log into my back office as my own personal GW, you know, it's my own personal GWP account. Um, so what I'm going to do is go ahead and log in here and I am just going to go over uh, some few things that you guys need to make sure that you do uh, first and foremost is that you want to make sure uh, before you start marketing you want to make sure all of your information here is uh, filled out correctly so that everything ties back to you to make sure that you get paid uh, from your marketing e efforts. Um, the next thing that you guys want to do is once you are in your back office you see this training site here. Now on the training site is pretty much where you are going to go and get uh, places to advertise and also the advertisements. So once you're on this training site we have a copy and paste tab up here. So what you want to do is click on copy and paste and scroll down here. Uh, just give me a little bit my computer is freezing. Um, and excuse me. <clears throat> you're going to see some buttons here. Um, you know they're they're real short, sweet and simple reads. Uh, so what I suggest you guys do is go ahead and make sure you read uh, Marketing 101. And this is basically a short, short paragraph, a short uh, you know narrative of, of the basics and fundamentals of marketing. So make sure you guys read that to make sure that you understand how to market. Um, also, step number two, this is where you're going to get your ad writing guide. Once again, guys, I'm just going to touch over this information. Uh, what this webinar is going to be about for the most part is about the advertisement itself how to market uh, what to do where to go things like that so those are things that you guys can read on your own I'm gonna jump right here in the meat and the potatoes of the uh, webinar and go straight to the ad center now this is where you're going to find your ads now depending on uh, where you're placing your ads we have pre-written ads that are already uh, written for you guys so that way you can target prospects in two different niches you have the business opportunity ads uh, and this is the and these are the ads uh, you know looking for people who are looking to you know make money from home uh, you know earn extra income these are these are the ads for those type people so this is where you're gonna find these ads and once again depending on where you guys post the ads and I'm gonna go through this go through some uh, examples here of how to post an ad here shortly um, but these are the business opportunity ads now let me go back now for those of you who want to uh, <clears throat> target the job seekers uh, we already have employment ads uh, written as well so these ads are catered to the job market catered to people who are looking for work work from home so um, get with the paychecks basically encompasses both business opportunity and work from home opportunity so that way you know with these two sets of ads you can you know hit your target market so what I'm going to do from this point is um, go back over here to the places that you need to advertise now once again there are a lot of free places to advertise and there are some um, where you know uh, there are some classifies and places that I'm going to go over and recommend that you uh, you know there's a cost but I will say this now I do understand that not everyone you know in the beginning can afford to uh, you know can afford to, 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 to go with the paid advertising route but I will say this that any business if you if you plan to scale your business um, you're gonna eventually have to spend money free advertising will only get you so far it can produce a nice income but there's a lot of work involved uh, maintaining uh, or, or posting classified ads now once you guys are in profit mode from posting your free ads <clears throat> this is when you want to scale up 
and start diving into some uh, paid marketing. But for right now, what I'm going to do is just go over, uh, you know, some uh, just a just a posting on Craigslist, just a few places, just a few free places to show you guys how to actually post a classified ad. Now, um, I've actually already posted an ad on Craigslist earlier today, and this actually happened to be a paid ad. You can see it right here. It says get paid to post on Facebook and other social networking sites. Now, uh, once again, well, let me back up. Let me go over free places to advertise first. So just for an example, um, I am going to go to Backpage. All right. So Backpage is a free place to advertise. It's very simple to advertise on Backpage. If you have an account, um, basically you would just come to Backpage.com, pick any city. Um, I'm just going to pick any city. And I am going to click on business opportunities. I haven't been on Backpage in a while or posting an ad on Backpage, so I'm not sure if it's free or um, a dollar. Let me let me log in and see. So I am logging into my Backpage account, and if you guys don't have one, it's really simple. You can just go sign up for an account right here. Very basic information. Um, all right, so let me see. This is when's the last time I posted an ad? Two seven thirteen. So, oops, sorry about that. Uh, let me sign back in here. Okay, so the last time I posted an ad was on two thirteen. Sorry, two seven thirteen. So I'm gonna go back over here and just choose a city, Jonesboro, Arkansas, and this is going to be a business opportunity ad because Backpage, uh, I've posted on Backpage before and I made some money posting in the job section, but they've gotten pretty tight. Um, so as you see here, these are all, uh, you know, like Backpage likes brick and mortar traditional jobs that you have to go into, that there's an actual physical location. So I'm not going to be posting a, um, I'm not going to be posting a uh, job ad here on back page so I'm just gonna go right over here to the business opportunity section and I am going to post an ad so what you would do is click up here on post ad just pick a city I'm just gonna put pick Fayetteville they have, you know a lot of cities have multiple uh, suburbs within them so just pick the one that you feel uh, that you want to post in so this is just gonna be a test uh, ad. So what I'm going to do is just come back, come back over here, and I am going to use a business opportunity ad from the training site. All right. So let's just do this. Boom. So what you would do is come over here. This is how I copy and paste. So forgive me. Um, so what you would do is come over here. And copy and post a title. The titles are here. They're long in the ads. These, um, this is the title here. This is the rest of the ad. So what you want to do is make sure you put the uh, body in the ad. And then what you want to do is come back over here and come back to your Get Weekly Paychecks back office. And you want to choose a capture page that fits um, this ad. Since this is a business opportunity ad, as you guys can see, we have different uh, capture pages to match the ad. So this is a business opportunity ad. Let me read the ad and just watch a short video that will explain. It's very simple. Uh, in addition to the $80, you have the opportunity to make more. Okay, great. So this one, I would say uh, this one right here, this red one. So what I'm going to do is make that my primary. And as you can see, this shows up here. Now, since I am posting this on Backpage, what I always want to do is wherever you guys post, you always want to create a campaign. So what you want to do is click on campaign and obviously uh, this is back page. So what I usually do is just put where I'm posting the date. And if it's free or paid and if it's free, <clears throat> uh, I'll put free and if it's paid. I'll put how long, sorry, how much I paid for the ad. So. Here's what you want to do. Now, as you can see here, this is this you get a long, big uh, link here. But what you can do is you can go to Google and just type in URL shorteners, and you'll come up with a list of URL shorteners that um, 
you know, that are back page friendly or, you know, Facebook friendly and things like that. As you can see, there's a Google URL shortener. So what I would do is come over here and paste that in there and to shorten the URL. They're going to make me confirm it. B-O-V-I-S-A-V. You're going to verify that. So as you can see here, Google, this is the uh, URL shortener. So I would copy that, come back over here, put a call to action, click here now, and put the link there. Now, this is for URL shortening. The Google, as you saw here, uh, Google has a URL shortening. It's uh, called Googly, or I don't know how to say it, Google. <laughs> um, so, but what I want to introduce you guys to is something that's called a rotator. Now, a rotator is used to rotate different websites. And as you can see here, um, here's an example of I just posted some ads on Craigslist in Dallas, like I had showed you earlier. But what I wanted to do is I wanted to test out the different capture pages. As you can see here, uh, I named the, 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 the capture pages blue red 45 job seeker free video so these are all the capture page choices that you have here in your back office and as you can see here on the tpm rotator this is a site that you guys need um, if you guys want to this is basically for split testing and tracking uh, which page is converting the best for instance if, if i refresh this you'll see I just started this campaign and you can see pretty much all of them have 12 hits so what I need to do is come back over here and my get with the paychecks well you'll see the names um, hold on you'll see blue obviously this is the blue page um, you'll see red 45 the reason I put that one there this is this page is red and it says if you have 45 minutes a day um, job seekers that is uh, this one right here and and free video this is this one right here this page right here so what I want to do is go back into my campaigns so I go back into my stats and I want to see which of these pages are converting the best so what I do is come back over here and click on campaign stats and let's see which one of these pages are converting the best okay Dallas blue is converting at 30 percent free video is at 18 percent job seekers is at 10 percent and red 45 is at 30 percent so this gives me an idea of which ones uh, which page I need to use so it's a it's a tie between um, it's going to be a tie between red right red 45 actually this is another campaign that I had set up yesterday so what I'm going to do the winner here in this one is going to be red 45 so what I'm going to do is come back over here and TPM rotator and take out all the other links because this one is converting the best now um, with TPM rotator they do have two they have a free uh, subscription and they also have a paid subscription the paid subscription is only five bucks a month but it gives you unlimited rotators and the free subscription they have they actually have kind of like a, a a banner across the top so that it kind of this you know it, it, it has their logo and stuff so that's that's what you get for free but for five dollars a month you get unlimited rotators you can actually uh, you know put this link if you want to you can take this link and put over here in the uh, back page ad put that there or if you just want to shorten it it doesn't matter but that is how you want to this is this is a tool that you guys need to actually be able to split test your marketing and your pages to see which one is converting the best so with that being said okay so just to finish out the free ad um, you, you can, this gives you an option to, uh, you know, put in your zip code and stuff like that. Uh, this gives you some other options to, I don't want to hide any email inquiries. Um, you have the choice here to, uh, post the ad, uh, 
uh, repost the ad every day for a small charge and you also have the opportunity to pay for a sponsored ad um, basically a sponsored ad is one of these ads over here um, sponsored ad is one of these ads that show up on the right that is in the yellow so I do recommend you guys you know uh, spending a little bit of money this is very cheap you know a dollar here two dollars there but as you can see these ads here on the right stand out a lot more than the ones here on the left so this is just a um, you know brief tutorial of how to post a free ad on back page um, what I'm gonna do now is go back over here and just just look on the um, on the training site for more places to advertise now like I said the, the, what I want to do in this webinar is just basically give the newbie a, a understanding of how to get this G get their GWP system working and just to give you know common sense to you know to, to free marketing and paid marketing and also the benefits of it so what I'm gonna come back here is uh, what I'm gonna do is come back over here and go to places to advertise now like I said, you have, you know, tons of good places. Now you have Sales Spider, um, another free place that you can post opportunity. You can uh, you, you post free or paid ads in here. So basically, what you want to do is, you know, f create a free account and just go through the process just like I did before. Basically, once again, with the ads that you have, we have tons of ads over here in the um, in the ad center, but. I, I do want to let you guys know this is that when I'm ever if there's ever a, a you know a, a time where I'm stuck and I can't and you know I've used up all the ads and I want to try something different to be honest with you what I do is I actually come over here to back page or any uh, classified site and I just look at uh, I just look at their ads and I just choose one that I haven't seen before that makes sense um, Sometimes short, sweet, and simple ads are the best. Sometimes, well, I know for a fact that writing long ads are not effective. You just want something short, sweet, and simple. So, um, this is how I choose ads. Sometimes, if I, you know, don't feel like using ads over here in the ad center, I just go to different, uh, different classified sites and just look at their ads and make them work for me. This is how I do it. So now another thing that I want to let you guys know of is this website called Alexa.com. Now Alexa.com is basically an internet ranking website that gives sites uh, their traffic. Uh, they do have a toolbar. I actually have the toolbar ins installed here on my um, on my browser. So just to give an example. Uh, let's look at back page and this is for anywhere that you want to post a classified ad you always want to know that they have good or decent enough traffic to be profitable for you so let's go click back over here on places to advertise and I'm going to show you how this works so for those of you who you can either go to alexa.com or you can just click on toolbar and if you use Chrome or Firefox or whatever you just go ahead and uh, download that and let me show you what this does so let's just say you come over here to places to advertise and you want to advertise in ad post all right so well ad post is well what I do is click over here on Alexa you click on the toolbar and you'll see their traffic rankings um, you'll see that in the world Ad post is 4,998 in the world. Uh, USA is, let me scroll down. Let me see. USA is 12,483. So this will give you a overall view of what the traffic is like. Let's go to another one real quick. Let's go to, um, let's go to Sales Spider. Let's go see what their Alexa ranking is. So as you can see, we're on the Sales Spider site, um, and I click over here on their toolbar button, and it tells me that Sales Spider is 6,000 in the world. So that's not bad. So Sales Spider is a 
popular site a lot of business people here a lot of entrepreneurs as you can, as you can see I've actually used this site plenty of times and for years to do uh, marketing and it's always been profitable for me so this is just another site that you guys can use that I do recommend that you uh, you know uh, you can post free ads on sales spider and you can also post paid ads so once again I do recommend um, spending some money on your business because eventually that is how you're going to grow um, but like I said you know you do have places like Facebook Facebook does have a marketplace where you can come and play some ads um, let me show you how that works Facebook is free obviously Facebook is number two in the world besides Google well we already know it's Facebook and Google so there's no need for me to click on the Alexa button um, so let's just say okay oh well as you can see it popped up two in the world two in the US It's Google and Facebook all right so let's click let's go click on jobs All right, and then what you want to do is click on post. What are you posting? Uh, it's gonna, I'm just going to put work from home opportunity. I'm just going to put national expansion. Oops. And I got a pretty good ad that's been working for me. So I'm going to put this over here in the description. I have my domain name there. Um, you can add a photo or video. It asks for the category, jobs. I'm going to put in advertising and marketing for the subcategory, company. I'll put GWP. And once again, guys, this is just a test uh, test ad just to show you guys how to do this job title. I'm going to put um, whatever work from home agents. I'm just going to put referral agent. Job type, I'm going to put full time and it gives here <clears throat> the opportunity to choose the city that you're in. I'm going to use it there and also gives you the opportunity to post on your Facebook timeline for the sake of this video this is just an example so I don't want to post this on my Facebook wall but for those of you who do post the ads uh, I do recommend this because this will show up on your wall which will increase visitors to your posting so you just click on post and takes a few seconds and it should pop up here shortly okay well while that's taking while that's spinning uh, what I'm going to do is go over here to another place that I've used uh, this this right here is another uh, business social networking site It's called AppSense uh, AppSense does have a have have uh, advertising opportunities as you can see here they have advertisings on the right hand side of their site and these advertisings now well let me let me go back up AppSense you see that that's there in the domain name and if I click on Alexa here you see that AppSense is 2400 in the world not too shabby so AppSense is a great place to um, to market so for those of you who want to get an account with AppSense, here's what you want to do: is you want to go to uh, you want to go to www.appsense.com. Hold on. www.appsense.com forward slash invite forward slash pay me daily once again www.absence.com forward slash invite forward slash pay me daily so once you become an absence member um, what you want to do is just come over here and click on account and you want to um, 
promote click on promote on absence now you have two different options well you got a few different options it tells you where you want the ads are so wait where you want the ads are where you want the ads place if you want them right there in the uh, content area or if you want a sidebar ad or uh, you have user ads and these ads uh, appear on the pages such as articles uh, discussion boards and things like that I usually like to do the, the uh, sidebar ads as you can see here I have some uh, posted already so what you would do is come over here click on new ad and come back over here this is a place for business opportunities so I would come back over here to the training site come over here to the ad center we're going to go to short sweet business opportunity ad uh, just for an example let's go uh, short simple headline now since this is a business opportunity ad and we can track it what I would do is come back over here in my back office choose one of the capture pages which one I'm going to use uh, just for example sake I'm going to make this one my primary and I'm going to create a campaign absence APSEN is absence today's date 416 and this ad is 10 bucks to show up and I think they last seven days okay so yeah for his ten dollars a week so uh, if I chose one week I'll put seven so I'll put ten dollars put ten dollars in seven days just so I know how long the ad lasted so I come back over here boom get this campaign code take it back over here to absence put that in there you don't need a URL shortener um, or Google shortener just just so you know the shorteners you only want to use a shortener when it's blocked when they block to get wiki paychecks because what happens is sometimes you know places like uh, 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 Facebook you know get wiki paychecks has grown so big that you know Facebook is kind of funny and when people post get wiki paychecks links on uh, Facebook sometimes they get banned so this is this is you know URL shorteners is for to use when you uh, want to get around filters. The rotator is used to uh, track different campaigns, sorry, to track the conversion rates for your pages, so that way you make sure that you're using the best pages for your ad. Okay, now I could go ahead and make a rotator for this new ad here but for time's sake I'm just gonna leave this uh, I'm just gonna leave this capture page that I just chose as the main uh, as the main capture page so come back over here that's the headline I want to use um, I'm just gonna make this short sweet and simple boom 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 click the ad let me see you get a uh, hundred words okay I see what it did All right, no bull. I was gonna put no bull, no hype. I guess I can't put there, put that. So I just put no bull exclamation point. And once again, this is just for an example. And what you come down here and do is click the industries that you want to target. So definitely affiliate marketing, um, business, internet, e-business. You get up to five, I think. Career. And let's see what else they have here entertainment, language, relationship. Let me see environment, computers, gaming, legal, uh, finance because money obviously has to do with finance. So, you and you hit choose here, um, how many weeks you want this ad to run. And if you want a image to show up, I'm just gonna pick a cool little image, I'll just put brand new and uh, click OK.
and this gives you an ad preview to show you how your ads and as you see here here's a checkout button um, so you just check out and pay your 10 bucks now another good thing that AppSense has is a solo ad service um, obviously solo ads are one of the the easiest ways to get traffic to your site basically what a solo ad is is you're basically leveraging AppSense's database to send out mail uh, to their to their database about get weekly paycheck so go ahead I do recommend using their service for solo ads uh, you do get clicks you're gonna get a lot of traffic to your site um, I have you just used this service and I have made money from it so I do recommend using the solo ad service from AppSense um, now let me see what else I have here there's a few other things I want to go over oh now Here's a free way that you guys can get you have unlimited free leads okay now if you go to Craigslist in any city I'm just in Dallas right now in any city in Craigslist you have a section here of people who are posting their resumes well guess what these people are looking for a job and they're looking for work and they're looking to make money well guess what you have you have that perfect opportunity so basically out of all the 500 600 cities that are in Craigslist you basically have an unlimited free way to generate leads they're basically there in front of your face uh, once this comes up I'm going to show you exactly what I mean it's a little slow here okay so I'm in the resume section of Dallas so what I would want to do as you see here all these people are looking for jobs okay uh, experience pho photography photographer um, people handyman things like that you don't want to to, 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 to recruit a glass fabricator or, or, or a, a mechanic tech not saying you know there's nothing wrong with those people but as far as your target market and for what we're doing even though these people may want to expand their horizon but for you you can you can definitely offer the opportunity to these people but what I want what I usually like to do is target people who a have a computer most likely have a computer uh, have some common sense about what's going on with the internet and just some type of you know internet skill so basically what I do is just come in come over here type in like customer service and I do a search all right so what I would want to do is look at this one right here well-rounded with extensive work experience so with this basically what you're doing is uh, and to be honest with you I don't even read the resumes I just look at the um, their uh, you know headline and if it makes sense to me I just respond to them so what you can do is up here you'll see a reply button so what you want to do is click on reply and you can reply to this person by using your Gmail Yahoo Hotmail or AOL so I'm just gonna click on Gmail and basically I would write something like hey I found your resume on CL it looks like you would be a great fit for our company and then right here I would put your GWP link so if um, if you want to change your capture page just for reverse marketing now this is actually called reverse marketing because you're going to where the leads are and as you can see here there's tons of lead look at all these people who um, you know even though it says seeking a front office reception position that means this person is obviously has computer skills they know what they're doing so you would just respond to people now don't take your time out to read every single resume and also Craigslist only allows you to do up to 25 it's either 25 or 50 per day so don't overdo it just basically choose a city 
hit hit up 25 or 50 per day that's it that's all that you need to do don't read the resume just look at the title and say hey does this person does it make sense for me to contact this person experience admin assistant yes that makes sense 10 years customer service experience yes that makes sense um truck driver looking for work uh warehouse delivery truck driver forklift does it make sense to contact those people no not really so what you want to do is choose whatever um I, use, I, like, I like to use the uh, black capture page here. I'm uh, sorry, the blue capture page for uh, reverse marketing Craigslist. So I'll just come over here, create a campaign. I'll just put reverse market. Today's date. The city. And the keyword was customer service. I'll just put CSR. So boom. Put that over there. Paste it. And that's it. Hey, I found your resume on Craigslist. It looks like you'd be a great fit for our company. Check out. Check out. Our site now. You can get a little bit better. I'm just this is just for, you know, example purposes. That's it. You click send and boom. Boop. There you go. You just contacted someone who is looking for what you have. How cool is that? So. This, like I said, we went over a few things, uh, a few free places. Uh, let me see if this Facebook, oh, an error occurred. So let me see if it can go again. Okay, looks like it's going through. So, boom, it says your, um, I can view the uh, Facebook listing. Here it is. So, boom, there you go. And this is on Facebook, and it gives me the opportunity to share it on my page, which I chose not to. Um, and this is just how easy it is, guys. So a few things that I want to recap is always use this resource, your copy and paste, to find the places to advertise. Now, let me back up. Now, for those of you who want to really, really take your GWP business on uh Oh, just 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 knock it out of the park. What I suggest you do is come down here, click on this banner here, and there is this new viral Facebook formula that uh, has been taking the internet by storm. And this this um, this new technique has been generating people hundreds and hundreds of leads for GWP. This is why we put this back there because this works so if you guys are looking for a uh, easy way no software non-technical uh, opportunity to get leads this you need to check viral Facebook formula out it is definitely worth every single penny so um, and once again we have other places over here in the resources section um, you know that these are you know we have ten dollar solo ads these are solo ads that are that you know cost you ten bucks and like I said when we talk about paid marketing you know people get scared and think that um, you know you got to spend hundreds and thousands of dollars you don't have to do that you eventually you want to scale to that but we do have resources back over here that uh, you know ten dollar solo ads Hercules um, Hercules is a great source for mailing um, basically Hercules has a list of their existing customers you can come in and choose to mail their members which is great Hercules has been around for years and we use them all the time and you as you see here you have free membership a pro membership and a gold membership um, you know choose which one fits your budget if you do have the money go ahead and upgrade to gold I do recommend it because this allows you to, to mail pretty much their members every day so you know like I said we have tons of tons of things over here that you guys can use uh, for free and paid techniques this webinar is just to give you a, an overview of the options that you have how to place the ads how to track your campaigns how to use a rotator um, you know how to place free ads how to place paid ads and with that being said we're going to be holding more of these webinars on a weekly basis to help you guys you know get up to par with your marketing um, be on the lookout for these webinars 
Uh, it's going to be power pack. We're going to be holding a lot more calls. So with that being said, this webinar is over. I hope that you guys got some insight on a few techniques that you uh, that you can use to get this off to a fast start. Don't forget, you know, don't forget reverse marketing in the resume section. Uh, don't forget your URL shorteners. Uh, don't forget the TPM rotator and once again if you do forget any of this please just rewind this video and with that being said this webinar is a wrap